Hello everybody and welcome to the Hydraulics Conference 2021. So this will actually be a walkthrough across the Gather Town space where we'll be using for the poster presentation, the speakers Q&A and for the free discussion sessions. The link for the Gather space can actually be found in the abstract booklet or the email that was sent to you. Together with it will be a password. So once you actually click on the link, right, it will lead you to this page. And before you enter the space, right, um, please ensure that you um, allow the browser to access your microphone as well as your camera. Okay. Okay. So immediately after that, right, you'll be led to this um, character customization page. So uh, let's move on to the next step. When you're naming a your character, right, please ensure that you put your um, real full name. This is to ensure that uh, other people in the conference uh, will be able to identify and uh, easily locate you uh, and talk to you if need be. Okay, finish. Yeah, so um, make sure that um, all the hardware is over here that is linked to our functional and with that you can actually join Gather. Come to the Gather Town Space for Hydraulics 2021. Okay. So firstly, the bottom panel, okay, if you click here is when you can change and customize your avatar. And if you click here, right, you'll be, you'll be able to change your name as well as your status. Please um, add in your organization or the university that you work at so that people, um, as said previously, can identify you um, easier. In the case that you are lost somewhere in the space, you just click this button and you will be transported back to this common room. See the list of participants over here and when you click on it you can see that I can actually message the person. I can also locate the person in the map even if they are on a different room or I can follow the person around as they move through uh, the space. In addition right there's also a search uh, panel here where you can actually um, type in the name of the person that you're looking for and uh, locate them as well. Okay, so moving on from the um, participants tab, there's also a chat tab. Okay, so you can actually send a message, right, to people who are nearby, to everybody in the room, or to a specific person. Okay, let's move on to the settings. This is where you can toggle your audio and video functions. And under general settings, right, you're also allowed to control the level of zoom or magnification you want for the space. Okay, um, let's say that previously you have already made a Gather Town um, account, right? You can actually sign in over here. And signing in actually enables you to bypass the password input um, every time you try to get into this space. Okay, so as you can see here, right, um, there are three main uh, rooms. So the first one at the top right is the poster hall where all the posters and poster presentations would be. Next right would be the speakers hall where after um, the speakers talks and presentations, they will actually be holding their Q&A over here. And last but not least right would be the discussion rooms where there are many rooms you and the other participants can actually talk, discuss and um, socialize with one another. Uh, this space right, will actually be open throughout the entire conference and approximately two weeks afterwards. Okay, so the first place that we'll be visiting will be the poster hall where it will host the posters and the poster presentations. When you're walking around the space, right, you will actually see right, uh, a preview of the posters kind of pop up as you um, kind of walk past them. So if you're uh, interested in a particular poster, right, um, you can actually right, stand near it and then this prompt will actually pop up saying press X to view the poster. And the poster should appear like so. Okay, so you can zoom in, you can zoom out, you can kind of drag it around, it's up to you. If you are the poster presenter, right, what you have to do is actually to stand behind the podium and on top of the cyan square, press X to maximize the poster. So if you see you see this button on the right side, right? This is actually um, the button for the presenter mode. Uh, any mouse clicks that you make on the poster itself can actually be seen by the other people who are viewing the same poster. 
However, right, if you want to scroll up, scroll down, zoom in, zoom out, right, um, these maneuvers can't actually be seen by the uh, audience. The case that you want to present something that is beyond the poster, let's say you have uh, extra video or you want to show some, them some other data or things like that, um, you can actually click the screen share button uh, located at the bottom panel. If you are a participant and you want to listen to this presentation, okay, you should actually stand within this box that is located in front of the poster and similarly press X to view it. Okay. However, if let's say right, you don't actually want to listen to the speaker talk but you just want to casually view their posters, right? What you can do is right, you stand outside the box around the periphery of the poster and press X. Okay. In the case that the pres the presenter of the poster right um, is actually um, not present in the space at the moment, uh, you can actually find their email addresses in the abstract book. With that, uh, let's move on to the next space, okay, to the speakers hall, where the speakers of the current session will actually hold their Q and A. Yeah, so each speaker will be entitled to one individual room. So please make sure that if you have any burning questions that weren't answered during the short five minute Q&A uh, session in the webinar, uh, please come here during the Q&A session. Uh, so when you enter right and you have a question you want to ask, right, uh, please line up at the right side here and queue up for your turn. So when you step into the science box, you can see at the bottom, right, this is prompt that says that whatever you say, right, will actually be broadcasted to the whole room. This is to ensure that the entire room will be the entire room, including the speakers, right, will be able to hear your question. Similarly, if you are the presenter, right, please step on the science box behind the podium on stage. Whatever you say in the answers that you're giving are will also be projected to the entire room. Okay. Uh, so for both the presenter and the person asking the question, please ensure that you are unmuted while doing so. Yeah. Okay, so in the discussion room, right, you can actually see a lot of like smaller rooms. At the top part, right, okay, you see uh, on my left side and my right side, there are two very big meeting rooms. So when I step into the meeting room, whatever I say can be heard by anybody in the meeting room and vice versa. Okay, and what's so special about the meeting room is that it can accommodate many, many people as well as um, having a whiteboard for um, your use. So to act, actually get this um, whiteboard tool where we are allowed to type things, draw things, create shapes, make notes. So this board can also be found in the second discussion room. Say you are looking for um, smaller private meeting spaces that can host maybe from two to six people, right? You can try using um, the lounge or the canteen. So um, for example, right, if I go to the lounge, right, like these seats, right, these small carpeted areas, uh, yeah, it hosts about maybe two to five people maximum, yeah. You can host about six people. If you have any questions regarding the space, if you're lost or anything, right, um, feel free to actually um, find uh, anybody by the name of uh, MBI admin, okay? As you can see here, MBI admin and uh, send them a private message or uh, come up to them and talk to them, ask your questions or anything. Yeah, but let's say if you have questions that kind of, uh, uh, extend beyond this space, right? Um, feel free to send an email to mbi-conference at nus.edu.sg. So with that, uh, we've come to the end of the walkthrough. We hope that you find this um, very useful uh, and we certainly hope that you find the conference enjoyable. So thank you for joining.